So something to definitely think about with with those collaborative team meetings and as you're structuring those to really think about how is it not just responding to the needs of students, but responding to the needs of of our our staff members and um, that in the moment PD that we can engage in through that conversation. Well, and and as you said, it's in the moment too. When we think about our collaborative team meetings, we're bringing forward issues that you are experiencing right now, right? And talking about how do we resolve some of those issues that are happening for students, and then we, of course, create this beautiful brainstorm of ideas that we can use. So we're coming up with, we're accessing all of those toolboxes, but even more at the end of that brainstorm, we come back to say, so what is one thing I'm going to do right. for Doesn't the student in my classroom? No, just one thing. And I know which student I am going to use that particular strategy with because uh, I surfaced that student in this conversation. So it becomes really empowering. And the irony of this is that if we engage in that conversation and we hear crickets, there's not really ideas that are surfacing. Wow, that is, a, is an, an opportunity. Area, opportunity that we need to bring in professional learning because it's obvious that our, our toolboxes aren't well equipped in that area. So it, it again comes around full circle where now it becomes very purposeful when we're engaging in that professional learning. As we talk about the collaborative team meetings, we often say everyone comes to those meetings as both learners and experts. Mm -hmm. And we have so much to give, to teach each other. We've got so much uh, understanding yeah, and expertise that in around. the buildings. Tumble. Absolutely. And you think of when we give that, we use those the structure and process of, of a collaborative team meeting to engage people in that discussion around powerful learning, it becomes a really great opportunity for us to create sustainable learning that is hugely impactful because we surface that learning um, as identified through students that we're struggling with or that there are students who are experiencing mm -hmm. key issues. 